The health of your gearbox oil is just as important as your engine oil. Check your service manual to see how often it should be changed and cross-reference your car with the Newlon Lube Guide to determine which gearbox oil to use. This can be found in-store, online or on the Newlon app. Once you have your Newlon oil, you'll also need the following. A jack and jack stands or car ramps. A lever bar, socket or spanner, depending on your car. New drain plug washers if required. An oil drain pan. Some rags. Disposable gloves and an oil pump. These can all be found at your local automotive reseller. Oil is best drained warm. To warm up gearbox oil, you need to drive the car for five minutes. Once so, turn the car off and raise it up. Remove any splash guards and under trays. Then start by loosening the gearbox filler plug. Then loosen the drain plug on the bottom. Make sure the drain pan is in place before removing the plug completely. Allow the oil to drain for five minutes or until it stops. Install a new drain plug washer if required and tighten the drain plug to the specs found in the service manual. Add the required quantity of gearbox oil using the oil pump or the oil bottle nozzle if you can. The gearbox fluid is full once it reaches the level of the filler hole. Some fluid will overflow once it's full, so clean this up with a rag. Then reinstall the filler plug and washer if necessary. Check for any leaks before reinstalling the splash guard. Check with your local council for the best way to dispose of the old oil, or you could speak to your local friendly mechanic.